So can you explain like what makes an addiction, like define an addiction? Okay. So, so people can have an addiction to a variety of different things. You can have an addiction to a behavior. You can have addiction to a substance, okay? And an addiction is a compulsion, a craving for a substance or a behavior that gives a temporary relief, right? So that could be food, right? You can have a craving for food. That could give a temporary relief from your emotions. But what defines an addiction is having a negative consequence. So you can have an addiction to food. You know, people who are bulimic, right? And then they binge and then they purge. That's an addiction to food because they are compulsion. It makes them feel better for that moment in time. It's a temporary relief. Mm -hmm. has a negative consequence because they have a compulsion and it makes them very ill, right? You can have addiction to lots and lots of different substances, right? But there is a difference between a passion and an addiction. Yes, you can be addicted to exercise. But if you're going to be addicted to any exercise, anything I should say, then exercise is probably the best choice. But yes, you can become addicted to exercise or it can be a passion, right? You can become addicted to anything, right? But if it has a negative consequence. So the very definition of it is an addiction is a compulsion or a craving to a behavior or a substance that has a temporary relief. It makes you feel better for a period of time but has a negative consequence. That is how I would define addiction, and it can be applied to multiple things. That's it.